to go ahead and go on with our great new memorial for the day We have these as our six categories. They are business biggies, sports, opera, 1962, England, and finally, Notorious. Take business biggies for 200. <laughs> the Southland Corporation says, Oh, thank heaven for this top ranked convenience store chain. What is 7 Eleven? Oh, I had to put the number, not the word. <laughs> Nickname for a football. What's a pigskin? All right. A Philly becomes a mayor at this age. What is one? No. Four years, okay. Keep it going. Verity fans always want more of this Shakespearean hero. Who is Othello? He wrote Brunhild's Immolation Opera's Longest Aria, nearly 15 minutes in length. Richard Wagner. The New York baseball team that set a new record for losing. Uh, who are the New York Mets? All right, out of the hole. After the U.S. blockade, the Soviet premier ordered Cuban missiles removed. Who is Khrushchev? Kita Khrushchev, yeah. Her obituary in time read she was a star, though she never quite became an actress. Who was Marilyn Monroe? I'm gonna go all in. Launched July 10th, it was the first communication satellite. I'm just going to say what is Telstar. Yay! J. 
James Meredith became the first black to attend this state's old university. What is Mississippi? I got it right. This is Biggie's for 400. The leading restaurant, which also leads in youth employment. What is McDonald's? Business Biggie's for uh, 600, please. Four, the is. Edison's company combined with Thompson Houston to form this leading light bulb maker. What is General Electric? Correct. A Business Biggie's for 800, please. This Johnson & Johnson product survived a poison scare to remain the number one painkiller. What is Tylenol? Business Biggie's 1000. Number one pet food company. What is Purina? Yeah! <laughs> Offer for 600. La Stupenda is what Italian opera fans call this Australian soprano. Joan Sutherland. He was such a sadist, they have they coined the word for him. The Marquis de Sade. Alright. Known as the new Caruso, this Italian lyric tenor never attends operas he isn't in. Luciano Pavarotti. Makes sense to me. According to the rules, the strike zone in baseball extends from the batter's knees to here. The armpits. For one thousand points, the answer is Tamino's wonderful woodwind. What is the magic flute? That's right! Notorious for 400. In 1927, this gangster set an all-time record for the highest gross income in a year, some $105 million. Who is Al Capone? Notorious for 600. His fellow prisoners at Alcatraz altered his nickname to Pop Gun. Oh, Karen doesn't know. Incorrect. Therefore, her points get cut in half. No, nope, Michael doesn't know either.
Looking for Machine Gun Kelly. Notorious 800. Torquemada, who headed the Inquisition, was also confessor to the Spanish Queen. Who is Isabella? Notorious for a thousand. A nineteen sixty three scandal involving this war, Minister Rock Great Britain's government. Oh, Karen still doesn't have any idea. John Profumo. <laughs> this bowl game changes location every year. What is the Super Bowl? Sports for 1,000. For 1,000 points, the answer is... The number of laps run in the Indy 500. <laughs> 200, I was thinking that. But it didn't dawn on me in time. The only category we have left is England. Britain's 4 p.m. coffee break. What is tea time? Though he never slew any dragons there, he's England's patron saint. Who is St. George? Six hundred. Or er, oops. The nickname for London's financial district. The city, right. English barons forced this royal enemy of Robin Hood to sign the Magna Carta. Who is King John? The person in this post is also known as the primate of all England. Let's see if Karen knows this any better than I do. The Archbishop of Canterbury. So Karen and Michael are tied at 2,400 points each, whereas I am in the lead with 10,000. Let's move on to Double Jeopardy. Let's play Double Jeopardy. We have these categories. World War II. Crime. Bad words, or as bad in quotation marks, U.S. cities. Medals, and finally, ins and outs. Notice those words in quotation marks. All right, point buys range from 500 to 2,500, so here we go. DUI, the most frequent crime in the U.S., involves alcohol and this substance. What are drugs? A uh, crime for 1,000. For 1,000 points, the answer is... The crime in Dostoevsky's Crime and Punishment. That crime is murder. Hmm. 
Smuggling the fruit of genus Passiflora or killing a lover could be called this type of crime. Crime of passion. Oh, yeah. The bad guys. For the outlaws. Ins and outs for a thousand. What you usually do with a paragraph, what is indent? Australia's interior. What is the outback? Uh, ins and outs for 2000. From the Latin to lie down on, it's an office holder running for re election. An incumbent. Ice cream cones and iced tea were both introduced at this Missouri, Missouri City's 1904 World's Fair. What is St. Louis? Yes, it is a thousand. State whose Hollywood features dog racing and a beach boardwalk. What is Atlantic City? It's wrong? Ooh. Oh, wait, they want the state! Florida. I was wrong either way. Atlantic City's in New Jersey. Dang it. Oh, well. It's okay. It's okay. Don't worry about it. Check it off. Columbia, capital of the southern state, had no paved roads until 1908. What is South Carolina? Oops. During World War One, Germany torpedoed U.S. ships with side of this side of this, Virginia's largest resort. Virginia Beach. Oh yeah. Home of the Air Force Academy, it has over 300 days of sunshine yearly. Uh, what is Denver? No! Well, Michael doesn't know. Well, everybody missed out on that one. It was Colorado Springs, right state, wrong city. I'll take crime for two or no, it's not my turn. World War II, five hundred. My bad. General McCall's one word reply when asked by the Germans to surrender: "What is nuts?"
for 1,000 points to answer is... Firebombing in this German city is shown in the film Slaughterhouse Five. What is Dresden? The Big Three, Roosevelt, Churchill, and Stalin, first met this Iranian capital. What is Tehran? World War II for 2000. The only one of the Axis powers to surrender unconditionally. What is Italy? No, that is wrong. Germany, oh yeah. South Dakota region named for its poor farmland, not for rough frontiersmen. What are the Badlands? <laughs> what the Hatfields of Aquinas had between them, or Neil Sadaka 75 minutes? Bad blood. The first American offensive in the Pacific involved the capture of this Solomon Island. Guadalcanal. It goes on forever. Oh, I just figured it out. Infinity. Type of crime punishable by less than a one year sentence. Misdemeanor. A hobo's crime of having no permanent address or visible means of support. Vagrancy. The four most common strokes of this sport are the lob, drop, drive, and spatch. What is badminton? To tease unkindly word from practice of placing this animal in a barrel and setting a dog in after, what is a badger? Yay! So we know where the other daily double is. It's in the category of metals. I'm going to try 7,500. Soft, malleable metal Superman can't see through. What is Krypton? What? Lead. Okay. In the military, what being AWOL or in prison is referred to?
bad time. Proverb advises you to strike at this time. What is while the iron is hot? In common table salt, this element is the metal. What is sodium? Yeah! I've sniped the lead for now. Of the current penny, nickel, or dime, the one which contains the most copper. What is the... Nickel. Yeah! Silver white metal found in chalk, gypsum, and wonder bread. What is calcium? So I have 17,000, Michael 12,400, and Karen 11,400. Here we go. This will determine the $250,000 winner as we deal with the category of U.S. Geography. Okay, so Karen would go up to, or Michael would go up to $24,800. So I have to go $8,000 on this. See if I can pull off a win here. Here we go. The largest port city served by the St. Lawrence Seaway. I'm just going to say it was Buffalo, New York, and hopes that I get it right. Hopefully I will get it right. It's Chicago, so I got it wrong. Oh boy. No chance of me winning now. I'm going home with $25,000 this game. See you all for that next segment.